so good evening everyone this is dr rohit daniel the orthopedics faculty from docs tutorials i am very happy today because we have an amazing guest with us today who is none other than dr nihil and s who has secured an incredible rank of 85 in the recent inict exam so he is a dear student of doc tutorials and we are so proud of him that he has achieved this amazing rank so welcome dr nihil and s and uh, good evening sir good evening good evening and before we start this interview let me personally and from on behalf of doc tutorials extend him a warm congratulations uh, because the achievement that he has done is really incredible so i'll start by asking dr nihilan to briefly introduce himself we would like to know the place from where he belongs which medical college he studied and a little bit about his family also nihilan sir thanks a lot for the intro sir i am nihilan from kaivathur medical college uh, to 2018 batch like i'm from tirupur and uh, like i'm the first generation doctor in our family and, uh, yeah that's it <laughs> so who all are there in your family like uh, my dad is a pharmacist sir and uh, my mom is a my mom was working in a bank now she is a housewife sir okay wonderful i i bet that all your family members are really proud and happy today because of your amazing yeah sir. yeah very nice very nice okay let me ask you this which batch are you i think you are from 2018 from... batch right? 18 batch sir yes sir 18 batch and you finished your internship 6 months back and you were able to crack this exam right yes sir i think that itself is a wonderful achievement just taking 6 months to crack the inict exam is really wonderful i think that you were able to write the may exam as well can you tell me your rank then yes yeah, sir in may exam my rank was around 3.2k sir uh, like i was wonderful. unprepared for the exam i just gave it sir but uh, it was uh, good it was a good decent rank actually yes yeah, unprepared and 3200 is really wonderful man so just imagine the amount of improvement that he was able to achieve going from 3200 to uh, below 100 rank is not easy you may think that it is a, a difference of 3000 rank but it is not so the jump that you have yes. to make is really exponential and you can actually sense the amount of hard work he has done in it so obviously you have kept aside the last 6 months for complete training isn't it and study yes sir e- even okay. for neat i didn't prepare sir my focus was inicd only and uh, like i'm happy with the, oh, the results sir so you did write the neat exam right so uh, what was the rank yeah. then sir it was around uh, 4k sir 4000 sir okay so you could have got a uh, placement somewhere but you chose to write inict exam so yes sir why what made you be so confident and what make made you dream about inict sir uh, neat was never my first attempt uh, like it was never my main attempt sir uh, like i didn't even have uh, finished 50% of the syllabus so uh, i thought i should give a better shot and a proper shot in november inict and i was able to manage uh, Sir, mm. wonderful. So, in college, would you call yourself a topper or were you an average student? Sir, uh, I'll be usually in the top ten, sir. Uh, top ten. Usually, I think the top ten. Different, ten. yes. Because uh, yes. just from your rank being three thousand two hundred in the uh, first INACT exam itself shows the shows that you are a very good student. And uh, how much of preparing during your uh, undergraduate days and during your internship help in the, in the inct exam sir first two, two uh, according to inct the first two years are high yield sir so my first and second prof was strong i had covid uh, lockdown so i was able to strengthen my concepts in the first and second year by then so it was really good and the final year uh, uh, subjects uh, like we have to push hard even for the university exam so like uh, this was my base sir so since uh, the base was strong i was able to revise it in 6 uh, uh, span of 3 to 4 months and i was able to recollect all the basics sir. wonderful wonderful so do you think this time the inct paper was a little different from the other inct papers yeah like i felt the need second shift was like inct and inct was like need uh, papers sir. 
yeah, it was yeah. like except for the fact that uh, there were around 40 pvq straight uh, it was greatly asked 30 to 40 questions it was greatly yes, yes. asked in this exam yes there were many one liners and things like that no usually not yes, seen in any cp exam not seen in any cp okay so do you think that you were able to study well for the uh, entrance exam during your internship uh not at all in in our field like it is a very it is very very hectic yes so uh, only, only during the spm only during the psm postings we get to uh, read sir or else uh, we won't even get uh, time for uh, taking catching our books yeah i know that i know that so this means that this rank of 85 came from intense study of those 6 months isn't it so yes, sir, can you break down those 6 months of how you studied from your point of view sir june july august uh, till the september uh, half of the september it was my first week sir uh, like uh, uh, for uh, Uh, like it was my first week, sir. Then uh, September, uh, the mid of September to mid of October, it was my first revision proper. Then uh, I concise my notes to a uh, certain point so that I can revise twice in the last twenty uh, or twenty five days. So I was able to do it, and uh, uh, it was manageable, sir. That is very nice. So you are a PG Power Pack subscriber for Doc Tutorial, yes, sir. So uh, you were able to access all our videos, QRPs, grants, yes, and all. how do you think our yes, app sir. helped you can you just sir uh, like the question marks and grant tests were really good sir and uh, for videos uh, since i was i, I had to prepare for november university if i watch the full content i won't be able to finish it so i watched the selective subjects sir so uh, week topics from medicine by rahul raji sir path uh, like path since path is a heal subject i will obviously watch vandana puri ma'am's video there very much uh, there life saving videos for pathology sir so yes. i was giving the question banks and the gt sir uh, i was getting good ranks and uh, the question banks were really nice it was more than my expectation that was good. it were good sir yes very good then uh, another question that many students ask us whether they should start studying the subjects first and keep uh, si doing mcqs for later or should they do both of them simultaneously what is your approach sir uh, uh personally what happened in my need was i was able to cover 80% of the content but i didn't have the practice of doing mcqs so my rank was around 4.5k uh i sure i felt the uh, need to do mcqs from then and uh, daily i uh, did 100 to 150 medicine uh, like uh, initiate uh, pvqs uh, uh, that initiate pvqs uh, definitely help me and uh, question, without doing questions i don't think the content will uh, fetch you more than 150 correct sections without uh, the application that won't be that's no use of simply studying the contents yes yes so this is a very important point many students make the mistake of not doing adequate mcqs please remember that doing or solving mcqs in itself is a skill unless you keep on doing it repeatedly you may find it difficult during the exams isn't it yeah yes sir definitely so, so finally before we wind up this interview there are several students who would be looking up to you so do you have any tips or any guidance that you would like to give them for the upcoming yes, meet like, uh, for the upcoming meet i think uh, like they shouldn't burn out i think uh, maintaining consistency of 7 uh, to 8 hours is necessary rather than burning out by studying 14 to 15 hours a day since this is a marathon and not a sprint and uh, the second thing is uh, that in the 200 questions uh like 150 160 will be from the content remaining 40 will be up to our mcq solving and guessing skills so we should obviously develop it by practicing more mcqs uh or else uh, without mcq solving uh, like we won't be able to get a good rank and uh, the main thing i felt is uh, avoid silly mistakes don't overthink in the exam the chance of getting a question correct by not overthinking is uh, more than the chance of getting a twisted question right by overthinking so uh, i'll tell them to approach in a straight forward manner than overthinking sir just one more thing uh, did you have any tough subjects or if you had any like that how did you manage it mm, sir my anatomy and orthopedics uh, surgery were my weak subjects sir so uh, so my first uh, read i uh, started these subjects first i strengthened my concepts in these subjects 
and uh, in the end uh, in this research i was able to get all the questions right in surgery and all so i think strengthening weak, sub weak subjects is more than focusing on your uh, strengths sir okay weak subjects is more important than uh, focusing on your uh, more uh, strong subjects because uh, then only you will get all the uh, weak mcqs as right uh, so i think we should strengthen our weak subjects first yes absolutely that is another very important point certain some students have a tendency to completely ignore a particular subject uh, especially short subjects you should never do that because all subjects are equally important and if there is any weak subject that you have that must uh, you must give more time to that that is a very very important point so nehlan thanks for spending time with us i know you had thanks. a very full day today so we from doc tutorials wish you all the best for upcoming all the all your endeavors i hope that you get a specialty of your choice i forgot to ask you that what is the specialty of your choice what is going to be it sir uh, uh, i was fond of general medicine sir but now i am like uh, i like both radio and general medicine so i am thinking like i'm still in a fluctuation mm -hmm. more of general medicine than radio sir wonderful man wonderful so i would suggest that what your heart says you must take because that is what you have to do throughout your life no so whatever your heart feels you must choose that and all the very best for the rest of your career it was wonderful uh, talking to you and thank you and good night thanks a lot sir pleasure sir my my pleasure to interact with you sir yes yes mine too thank mine you sir too. good thank you sir thank you sir.